welcome back everyone. My name is Eltamar and we're going to be continuing our let's play of Dark Envoy. Where we left off last time, we just finished a side dungeon and then made our way to the next main dungeon. To that end, I think going forward, I'm just going to do the side dungeon between videos and then just do the main dungeon for videos. Uh, unless there's something particularly cool in one of the side dungeons that I want to show you. The reason for this is they don't seem to have a whole lot of story or lore associated with them. They're mostly just a quick explore, murder a couple things, grab some loot, and leave. Gotcha. They don't really have any sort of implications to the story other than a little bit of experience and some items. So let's move forward and see what we can do here. We're not supposed to get spotted by the League soldiers in theory. Look, Kayla. I think I see some League soldiers up ahead. We must be getting close to their camp. Let's try to stay out of sight. Alright, so we have to hide behind cover, apparently. The League's banner represents the three races, Elves, Cranites, and Shadow People, standing guard over the world's order. Let's grab this loot. Got some Elven Plate boots, those are pretty cool. We'll put those on later. We need to try and... Uh, Make our way through here without being seen. Uh, that guy's gonna get some vision around the corner here. Run, 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 run. So he's going there. Sure. He can just duck through here. Perfect. Now we've moved from one encounter area to the next encounter area. Ooh. How close is this guy going to get? Not super close. That was very close. Okay, let's go this way. Looks like they're out of range at the moment, so if we run... A barrel plastered with trading house insignias. Someone must have tried to hide it here. Sure. There is treasure over there, though. I'm going to put my group members up here. I'm going to grab one of them. Doesn't matter which one. I'm gonna try and carefully move back. So I want that treasure. And just wait to see what happens with this. Okay, so they're there at the moment. Oh, they're moving up. Let's get going. They're coming around this corner. Hopefully they're going to go down this way and we can move up to go see that treasure chest. They're going somewhere. Sure, why not? Ooh. Kind of like... Started to withdraw and then just went straight up. Is there a save? Yes. Let's grab a quick save here. And then we go. That's a very close call. Oh shit. They're moving up this way. Yes they are. I think they move in a circle, so as long as we stay behind them, we should be okay. Move to here and just wait it out. There is also a recruits journal there that we might try and read. Yeah, they just move around this perimeter, so it shouldn't be too hard to get through. Gotcha! Okay, let's grab the journal, then grab the chest. Can we pause right here? Kinda? Uh, can we read this later? You know what? I'll leave it on the screen for a minute. You guys can read it, and then we'll see if we can read it later. I'm going to hope that we can read that. It seems kind of unfair to have a Let's get going. reading thing like that in a stealth area like this. But, uh, sure. Might be in Codex, though. Yeah, the recruits turn. Okay, we can read it. Good. Sure, why not? We'll just read it when we get to the other side after we get around these guys. Gotcha. Well, that's getting close. Okay, a little too close for comfort there. Let's get going. And go. We are now safely over here. There is a branching path here, but let's read sure, that thing really quickly. Alright. So, 
Codex Priest Journal. The desert makes me nauseous. It's a barren wasteland, a ruinous landscape with no cover other than dry canyons. I don't like it, it feels wrong. It makes us vulnerable. The scorching sun is already taking its toll on us, and no one can tell how much longer it will take to scour this forsaken place. I doubt we will find the researchers, and to be honest, I don't care anymore. Our objective here isn't to look for lost people. Not really. If our superiors cared about the troops, they wouldn't send us here with barely enough supplies to keep us going. All they care about is the knowledge of the ancients buried under the sands, no matter how much they have to pay to reach these damn ruins. And our lives are a meager cost to them. I'm just another corpse for the vultures, a glorious sacrifice for the League. So they've been sent here with very little information. And possibly sent here to die. Sure. I don't know which way I want to go. There's just a dead person here. It looks like they were trying to force their way through the outpost, those poor people. I really think we should just move with one person. It might just gotcha. be easier in general. Uh, I'm gonna save. I should have gone. I can still go. We Let's saved. Let's get going. Just go see if we can uh, see what we can see over here. Sure. Why not? Oh, this is getting close. I don't know if I like that too much. The squad of three. I'll read that in a minute. Let's get going. Any treasure over this way, or is this just another waypoint? Looks like it's just another waypoint. Let's put him there. What's on your mind? And then she's gonna go this way, and then we'll just teleport her across. Any loot this way, maybe? There's a teleporter here, and an ore, and a letter. There is someone over there. They are moving a little bit. There is four iron in that thing. Who's that? I'm gonna save because I don't know which way these guys the are gonna go. Are back. Shh! Shut up! Oh, I got lost. All right, got caught. Let's quickly reload that. They moved while I was picking up the letter. That's fine. We just won't move out at that particular moment. Shouldn't be too hard to avoid them. If we don't want her to be by herself, she will very much gotcha. die on her own. So they do move now. To where? We're not moving now. The elves are back! Shh! Shut up! It's gone quiet again. I think they left. Do you think we... Oh, she wasn't on those caught. Why is he moving through here? Oh, I might... Okay, I see what happened. I understand. We had both characters selected by accident, and then he moved through their field of vision. I understand, I think, what happened. I'm going to double check to make sure he's not moving. Patience. What's okay, that? he's fine. I did a dumb. The elves are back! Shh! Shut up! It's gone quiet again. I These... think they left. Do you think we can come out now? Kayla? Is it the heat or did that barrel just say something? <laughs> I don't think we're going to get out of here. Sounds interesting. I didn't realize there'd be so many of them. There's scorpions everywhere. I don't think she can kill all of them on her own. I mean, she might be able to. All right, let's see what happens. Get to cover. And get your shield on. We're going to put the big attack here in a second once they all kind of... Yeah, it's good enough. Now we need to move, except that we can't move. Another fire apprentice. She's getting hit pretty hard. I think she's stunned or something. We definitely can't move I've her. This one. She's stunned or stuck, and I'm not sure which. You ask 
for this. Oh, she's gonna die. Yeah, there's no way. I think the fire elementals might be able to finish these things off, actually. But we're definitely gonna have to move our other character. To go save oh, yeah. her. Which is annoying, but okay, let's sure, go this. Why not? Oh, we can teleport. There's no point in walking. Let's get going. Gun. Here I come. It's time for gun. Moving fast. Okay. Sure. Let's go get her back up. There might be a heal. There's definitely a heal over there we can grab if we need to. She almost killed them all on her own, though. I'm actually really impressed with how many she managed to hold off before dying. Gotcha. Shipping manifest. A piece of paper supposedly is torn out of a journal of dis discarded nearby, written in a clear technical lettering with equal spaces and no smudges. Trade route from Phonicia to City of Bones. Some earrings, some pendants, some bracelets. Just a little walk. Oh, you're not League soldiers. We're definitely not. Don't worry, you're safe now. Why did you hide in? Matters not. Let's get moving. We've wasted too much time already. All right. Hold on. How did you fit? Disturbances on trade routes are more and more common, and with every moment wasted, we lose a client. We are thankful for your help, but please, can we go now? Are you sure you're all right? Better than ever. Come on, hop to it. Let's pick up the goods and go. I'm sure you will barrel through the desert now. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, we did manage to fight our way through this. There's a research thing here, though. That's kind of important. Which is primarily the reason I came back for this. Sure. Why not? There's quicksand, apparently. Um, I don't think I'm even sure. going to bother getting... For the health. Oh, there's definitely something over here. Looks like there's more scorpions, though. Nope. Elementals. That's fine. Either sure. one's fine. Doesn't really make a difference. At least they're not leak soldiers. That's all I care about. There they are. Cover me. And that should be the end of that. There's a treasure Let's chest. Get going. Which has garbage. Sure. I think we're going to do a big sell next time we uh, get to a safe zone. Back to town, I guess. More accurately. I mean, the healing is so close by. Yes. Let's save and see where they're Sounds at in their control. I actually think we're going to be fine. Okay, there we go. Alright, we're good. Let's teleport to the next waypoint and continue on our way, which is over here to the unusual vines, of which we have a teleport part or teleport point right by, apparently. Uh, but that's the way we're supposed to go, so let's go down this way. There is... Ugh. What's with the temperature here? I'm sweating my clothes off. It is significantly hotter here, but please spare me the details. Elementals? It's hard sure. to tell. Yeah, they're just elementals. We can fight them. We'll pull them back. You yeah, go to cover. That's me. I'm with you. You summon a thing. You fire at that one. Good enough. Get to cover. Wasn't the walk. ideal situation for him to move up that far, but whatever. Take Did they not that. decide to come and fight? Get over here. Uh, okay. Let's do this. Not the ideal placement for that, but fine, whatever. Let's get this going. Ooh, that was a terrible thing to have done. 
that does run ability in general. Someone just took a ton of damage from something. Are we standing in something weird? Probably. We healed up a good chunk though. This says, oh it's a wildfire. It doesn't say anything. There's a Healy thing in here anyways. Gotcha. Let's go grab a Healy thing and a chest thing. Uh, new duelist gloves. Unique sure. duelist gloves, I might add. Sounds on him, but he's got two glowy things left on it. What are you talking about? Apparently it's empty. It looks very glowy still. I don't know. It's fine. We don't really need it that badly. We should probably look at our armor situation, though. Our medium armor at the most, at least. I think we should give our mage armor. It's weird, I know. But, like... Well... It's a tough call. She's already wearing medium chest armor, so let's give her different medium chest armor. Let's give her some gloves. She's going to be our tank, kind of, until we have an actual tank. The reason that she should be the tank sure. currently is because mana shield still is incredibly good for holding off damage for a little bit. We really need an sure, actual tank character at some point, though. Hopefully we get something soon. Gather your party to venture forth. Oh, there's a... Uh... What did you learn from those wretches? They seem to know little of interest. They were headed toward a place called City of Bones, and claimed to have never encountered any of our expedition forces in their travels. Useless vermin. We shall continue our search then. Maybe the dwellers of this City of Bones will prove more informative. If I may, Commander. Do you believe we can still find the missing squad in this cursed desert? It may take months to find their trail. If they believe their research here could help us win this war, then it is our duty to find out what happened and continue their task if necessary. I don't care how long it takes. We will find these ancient ruins, even if you have to dig them up yourselves. Are they talking about these ruins we sealed off? Shh. Listen. Understood, sir. What should we do with the prisoners? They're worthless scum. Slay them and leave them to rot. You hear that, Kayla? We've got to do something. We can't let them kill these people. Wait, Mel. Maybe they can be reasoned with. We know what they're looking for, and we may be able to use it as leverage. Yeah, and we know exactly what they'll find there. We should have destroyed that archive when we had the chance. Do you really want to reason with these murderers? No, but we have to think this through. There's too much at stake. What if the League finds out we attack them? What if they blame our city? Well, we have to do something, and we better think fast. Let's attack them. Stop! Who goes there? Release these people immediately! Ha! What a foolish rescue attempt! Two arms! Okay, that, that. Seriously, more? And then this, and then this. Come up it. Oh, that was pretty much the end of the fight. They got evaporated. Now there's a treasure chest. Let's go deal with that before talking to the traitor. It's also a soul core. Elven... Ooh. An elven rifle. Two-handed rifle legendary. That is an upgrade. For him. It's under the bow setting. Okay. It's not a mass... Oh, it does 19 damage, 16 poison versus 35 physical. Pretty cool. Let's go grab the soul cage. Soul core, sorry. And that appears to be it. Let's talk to the traitor. I saved your life, you better have a loot. Are you alright? You're free to go now. Thank you so much. Please, uh, allow me to compensate you for your trouble. Thanks. 
We wouldn't be able to carry all this without a cart anyway. Now, is the way clear? Don't worry. We'll show you how to get to the city safely. I don't understand. Why would the League soldiers be so cruel to these people? The elves I met before never acted with even the slightest disdain toward humans. Maybe the old saying is right. And war really does bring out everyone's true colors. Sure makes you wonder, doesn't it? About what? Just what the League is capable of. You know, there may be some truth to the Empire's accusations against them. There's much we do not know about this war, and I'd have preferred it to stay that way. Let's get out of here. We need to report what we found out. Okay, we can do that. We have accepted $300, and that is actually all there is to do here. Let's take a quick glance, or take a quick glance at the map. Oh, we missed a mining deposit. Okay, go back and grab that really fast, and then we're done, I think. One more quick look at the map while we run. We looked at the banner. We looked at the shaft. We didn't kill any of the guards except the ones at the end. Not that I think that matters experience-wise. We've only gained 200 experience for this entire map. All right. Hey, Kayla dealt the most damage for once. That's because she killed all those scorpions basically by herself. Back to the city of Boons. See if we can snag another level from turning in a quest. Let's get going. Report back to Benedict. All right, let's go talk to Benedict. He's Sounds the furthest part or furthest point in this town away from our our group. Gotcha. This temple looks cool. I want to see this thing's face more, though. Whatever. All right, Benedict, what you got for us? So, Benedict, we scouted the League's outpost, but it didn't go as smoothly as we planned. I heard. The survivors have already reached the city. Thank you for bringing these people here safely. They've suffered enough. I just hope we didn't make things worse with the League. Oh, who cares? Let them come if they want. We'll be ready. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Don't beat yourself up over it, though. You were right to interfere. Thank but you. the day's not over yet, and the city needs your services again. Go talk to your parents when you're ready. I'll see you there. Okay. 4,500 experience levels us up, and we'll level up and then call it a video. We get to get level, power level 20 now, which gives us 20% more max mana. I'm looking forward to 25, though. That's our next big one, which gives us skill costs minus 10. Uh, we are currently level, what, 5? So we still can't get our secondary tree, but we do get this primary tree, so that's always fun. I think we're going to put some more points into charged ground to deal additional damage. It does quite a lot, so let's just grab 2 and 2... Grab two for charge ground and then another mana absorb so we can get that mana regen for five seconds on attack. I think that's important. Alternatively, we can get the additional range for our attack, which actually might be the better idea because we need to stand back and shoot things. That's really our goal, this character. We can also do some research. We have 40 research, which gives us a little bit of extra oomph. Let's get some regen. Let's get this shelter. Wait, do I do it both? I don't have to have both. Nice. It's one or the other to move up. So we're going to grab max health and then we're going to see what this next tree brings. Uh, skill power or movement speed. Don't really care about movement speed that much. Let's grab skill power. Upon killing three enemies within 10 seconds, your characters gain plus 25% attack speed and 25% movement speed. Alternatively, once per dungeon, we can resurrect or we can, we can grab the movement speed. Oh, wait. No, we can't. We're out of research again. That's fine. Skill power plus 10. A plus. First global skill, which was, I believe, emergency regeneration. Well below 50% HP, your characters regenerate 2% of their max hit points per second. Great. 
If I only have to do one, I want to get the scouting, so we're going to do both parts of this tree probably, at least down to... Well, actually, no, I just kind of want the skill power one. I might just go along this top part next to first aid drills, and then we'll do... Hmm. Then we'll do what? Maybe the attack speed one? Some. We'll get there eventually anyways. Uh, let's level up our other character. Kayla, you are also going to get your power levels up. And let's take a look at her skills. So she can get her mana up or she can get weapon overcharge, which... Maybe? Alternatively, we could get her... Breeze spike, or just more mana. I don't know what I want, man. We can also just hold on to her class points for now. I wonder if you can save them for your next specialization, or if you have to spend them now. We can reset all in anyway, or we can reset all later anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, well, let's keep our skills for now. We can reset them later if we really, really want to, I think. Yep, we absolutely can. I shouldn't have done that. I just wanted to test it. What else do we have before? That was... I'm missing one point in that one. There we go. Okay, we're back to normal. That's where we're at, I think. We do use ice bolts a fair amount. Get some extra oomph with the ice bolts. Sure, why not? I like how you can sure, respec any time. That's pretty useful. I think we're going to call it here, though. That is a good place to end. We'll start the next video by talking to our parents. Sounds interesting. I'm going to also sell things between videos. We just have so much junk at this point in time that when you really need to go through it and sell the rest, it doesn't look like there's any way to boost our sale prices. So we're going to go through and equip people with things and unequip people from some things. And then we'll see where we land on um, everything from there. Like always, if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, we'll see you next time. Take care.